At 11, with news of anger and mistrust within some communities, you can still find love on one quiet street in North Miami. And the man behind that message used to be one of South Florida's most notorious criminals. Take a look. You know, I look like the crazy old man in the neighborhood with all this hair, and I have a rather nefarious past. I was in the import business. You may remember Mickey Monday as one of the cocaine cowboys who put Miami on the map as the drug capital of America. First trip, we got paid $1.2 million. This is a great neighborhood. But he's left his criminal past behind, and these days he lives off his celebrity in North Miami. Now he's making a real difference in his neighborhood. He's taken a vacant lot the South Florida Water Management District uses to access the C8 Canal and turned it into Lock and Love Park. His message of acceptance is catching on in this community. Bring your padlock, hanging on for your dog, your cat, your lover, your kids, your father, your mother. And the idea is put the padlock on if it has a key, throw it in the canal so you're locked forever. And here's one that says... Together with up-and-coming young artist and producer Maurizio Raponi, he's turned a vacant lot next to his home into a park for all to enjoy. We want to get a lot of parks done like this, beautified and just promote, promote positivity and, and love. Maurizio constructed a huge mobile metal sign that advertises their message of love to everyone in sight. We're trying to make it so you can see love anywhere you are, whichever direction you're coming from. We like to say love has no labels. Love looms large over this park in progress. You can see the sign from the street, from the bridge, even from space. Monday has even turned the lawn into love. Their message? Instead of just talking about change, make it happen. People are always saying, oh, we got to do something. Well, I went out and did it. They hope this promising park could lead to more open spaces for everyone to enjoy all across South Florida. For Mickey, it's a chance to atone for his criminal past. Does it make up for it? Maybe so. I hope so. I think this should have been done sooner. Kind of like Paris. Since crews still use that land to access the canal, Mickey's additions are strategically placed so their work can continue.